It's scraping. Doesn't look good. It broke. Welcome back to the next episode of the fully furnished double wide trailer house we were blessed with for $500. This time we are going to show you the easiest method in the world that any of us knows of anyway for splitting and moving your own trailer home. We had no idea if we were going to pull any of this off. Fortunately, we had good friends willing to work mostly for beer in comparison to what most charge, who have split a house many times before, said they would never do it again, but were willing to give this wacky, harebrained idea of James a try. We're kind of looking at it from the top of it, and here's the round pad, and then it's got like a roller deal that goes along. Uh, and then side profile, like I said, kind of looks like a tank. Here's the top pad, and it rotates, it spins on there. Okay. So anyway, kind of like a turret of a tank without the barrel sticking out the front. <laughs> we don't have a barrel. <laughs> <laughs> So anyway, and then it comes down like so, kind of like a tank, uh, uh, not like so. This may be the ground. Okay, we'll pretend this is the ground. Okay. No, ha ha no happy mistakes here. Okay. <laughs> Bob Ross. <laughs> so anyway, and you got your rollers, and they run on like a track deal under here. Like a like a tank track. Yeah, and it's just it's a big old chain of rollers, and each roller spins, and the whole it, thing and, and the chain goes around like this, and like I said, they're good for 24 tons. Now there's three of them like that. Okay. And the, the oddball and, one. And, like. and the oddball one, it's kind of like so, kind of like this. And it's got a little rotating pad on the top too. But similar to this. Similar to that, except it's just got a big roller here and a big dang roller here. And it's it's good for probably pretty close to the same 24 ton. But it's not, I mean it's That's my pen, dang it. Are you trying to cabbage? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna doodle on your shit. <laughs> You want a doodle too? Yeah. Well, here, doodle. What else? No. Now, now, we... I'm, now I'm picturing like the Bugs Bunny cartoons where he's like, ding, 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 <laughs> ding. <laughs> now, <laughs> how wide are them? Dang yellow jackets. Freaking go away. Ah. Sis. <laughs> how wide are those? About five inches wide. Um, if you're standing on top of it, it's five inches wide. Five That's inches right. wide and woo, good shots. <laughs> uh, and I can't remember how long. It's probably about nine, nine inches or so long. So and then five this and, way. And, and height wise, it's probably about probably about four inches tall. The total from the bottom of the pad to the top of the other pad is four inches. Yeah. Okay, and we're five this way if we're looking down on it, and we're nine this way. Yeah. Okay. Railroad tie is only. Railroad tie is ten inches. Yeah. I had it figured out. I had it figured out where. You had the... it figured out. Because I had, I had looked into buying a big piece of channel iron 
And if I bought a 9 inch wide piece of channel iron, because it's measured from outside to outside, inside of the channel, that I could fit that roller right in there and it'd run like, a, like it was on a track. Because I was trying to figure on doing this myself. And so anyway. Or eight. With, with, width wise, we got plenty. We got right. plenty. So we're just going to stack them. Yeah. The only reason I was. Yeah, stack them, stack them too high. Man, we better hope that. The reason I'm wanting this, was wanting them stable, you know, put them side by side, was to be stabler. Right. Because I didn't want, you know, we stack two of these on top of each other, and we got the weight of that trailer. Well, if it goes this way or this way, well, it's going to go. No, oh, well, no, it fucking I, walks on us. Well, I was going to say we could set bottle jacks on top of them pads, but then you're back to the height thing anyway. It don't freaking matter. Anyway, you slice yeah. it. Anyway, you slice it. We got that. The same dang issue. We're just gonna have to. We're gonna have to take some of them boards, them two buys, them wider, like two by twelves or whatever, two by tens, and lay them underneath here, crossways. That way, this is sitting on something that's fairly solid on the ground. We'll have to make sure we got a level spot under there, underneath all the blocking and shit. Yeah, it, it'll have to be Cause, perfect. Because this ain't gonna, this ain't gonna teeter totter on its own. No. And it'll be, and, and, and it'll be between as as this one and this one if you stack them. Right. And they're fairly squared. We'll just have to make sure we just... And we pull slow. Yeah, come along slow. Yeah. And we have to have two anchors and just two come alongs nice and slow. Just I've, I've got one come along. I got a couple, three of them. I got four or five. So... So... Oh. I say we go, yeah. And like I said, if we do need it, I can get a, a winch truck. There's your pin back. Thanks. Can't say words like that on YouTube. Yeah, they'll demonetize you. Beep! <laughs> do you know how much... Beep and pin back! <laughs> <laughs> I charge James every time he makes me do another edit. <laughs> so, so far, so, so far, in other words, you don't like doing editing. So, so far, I'm in debt. So far, I'll never get out. Um, I, I, I'll have, help you out. I, uh, there you go. I, I ended up Thanks. having to marry her just so I didn't have to. <laughs> oh, dude, don't even go there. <laughs> the second one because she'd never leave. <laughs> That's not right. <laughs> got to do something with all them rocks, too. We got to get them out of the way. Load them in my truck. I want, I want that coral. Yeah. It's like rocks. Leave a rock. No. Leave it right. Where did you push the other ones out of my truck? He forgot. On the property somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Dock that day's pay. Happen <laughs> <laughs> on the job. Are we done with him today, then? I think so. I think we've pretty much got everything where we kind of need it to get the split, and I'm just waiting on the dirt work. Punch out for now. Give us that trace. <laughs> that trace you know. Hi, Baxter. Okay, so now what we're going to do, when we go to split and reset the trailer house, this is what we're going to use. It's a, a roller and it's kind of on a track type of design. You can see each individual roller and it's on like a chain link type of belt. So anyway, uh, there's a set of four of these. Unfortunately, one of them is missing. This is something I got from work. But uh, and then there's this oddball one, which it's still rated for about the same. These, these each individually will hold six tons. The whole set's supposed to take 24 tons, which a trailer house, you, you're not even close to that. So uh, that's the whole plan. We'll set it up onto some railroad ties, get everything all leveled out. 
and then uh, set the weight of the trailer house down on top of these and take some come alongs and pull it on out. So stay tuned, we're going to keep on going and get this thing done and over with. All right, we're starting to ratchet it out now, little by little. Them rollers are working out nice and slick. Just keep an eye on what you're doing, because cause, cause if, if you, hold on a second. Hey, if you pull to one side too far, too fast, it's gonna end up pulling them rollers off. Watching your rollers. Are we looking on the rollers? Are they staying pretty square on the on the ties? Good deal. Yeah, that's what it looks like. But then he said it's the opposite for him. So. Go ahead, Frank. You need to come out a little bit more. I see. Oh, damn, that was a big pull. What? Whoa. That looks like it's about ready to just freaking roll on its own. <laughs> you guys want to stand over there and get a little push and we'll watch it? Um, this roller is not centered on here anymore. Yeah, we're, th th this end, we're coming out too much on this end. Frankie needs to come out fast a little bit more. This end's coming out with you, Frank. Every yeah. time you ratchet, this end's coming out. Stop. We had a lower spin. We did? Yep. Yeah. Okay. We're done. How far away away? A couple feet. We're about three foot out, Frankie. Let's jack it. Put tires on it. Let's, yeah, let's. We're good. Yeah, we've got, we've got plenty. Yeah. <laughs> we got plenty. That was the easiest way to move a trailer ever. Fuck yeah, that was nice. Tired out of the excursion and pulled. Yeah. Excursion. Oh, yeah. Well, excursion. There's a grown up version here. There's a grown up version. <laughs> yeah, there's yeah, a small one of mine out there. Really. Heck yeah. yeah. So you might be ready to pull today. Might be able to. Well, we're going to. We'll get it plasticed off and then we'll pull it up out of the way. And then uh, tomorrow morning, that's when we're tugging. So, yeah, I pulled Charlie the, pull half of it. Turned out. Okay, so. Split. Oh, hell yeah. Well, as you can nice. see, it is split. We've got a few feet, probably four foot close. Damn. In between there. We've got it braced up. <laughs> we got it really braced up. Uh, there's, of course, the wall. So. 
Everything's good. Now, uh, now what we got to do is get the wheels back on it, get it set down on the ground, and then we're going to take the ladders in between here, and we're going to plastic everything off just in case we get a little bit of moisture, which from the frost there will be. So that's our next step, and we'll catch up in a little bit. Every one I've ever had is broke. Even the good one. Well, no, I'm, I'm talking about something that I don't have to plug in. I need a gas right. powered one. And, uh, Frankie said there's a somebody that. Uh, what the buckets in law or something has. He's a little wacky happy. Trust me, we're gonna go through a lot of staples. They don't call me wacker for nothing. 
because we're gonna have to go down through all the bracing and stuff mm -hmm. too. make sure we tack it up there and then across the bottom mm -hmm. once we get that plastic cut then we can tack that okay. bottom up good We've got a little bit of stress going going tomorrow's gonna be a little rough but I'm feeling better mm -hmm. I'm feeling a lot better mm -hmm. they all said this is the easiest they've ever seen a trailer house click it was a good idea using them bowlers yeah it was a really good idea I'm, gl I'm glad I, huh? I, I found those at work and knew <laughs> You only got a hold of the side to go. You know, with the five or six more passes, This section's a little deep in there. Hopefully, they can pull it out all right. Doesn't look good. It broke.
have to head to your side because of all the plumbing and whatnot on that. Mm -hmm. Not wrong, Where's my plastic boy? <laughs> You're right there. Hell yeah. It's out and oh yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. What's the matter, Frank? Nothing. I'm just in a good mood. This fucker's moving, rolling. She spun the front tires, but I got her out of the hole. We want to use. Once I had enough boost, it popped it right up out that hole. Kind of came up a little Dang. quick. <laughs> you were starting to spin your front tires, yeah, I was watching but there's not enough deep. weight on the back end, that's why. Do we want to put a bottle jack up underneath there? Yeah. Kind of help. Yeah. Because <laughs> I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, I got a sneaking hunch that's going to dig down into that wood and bust it. I have a, I have a hunch too. All right, jeez, you guys. I must have been jerking on that thing freaking hard to bend that hitch. No, I think it, it was when... weight. Just once it came up out of that hole, all the weight came down. Yep. The weight. Yeah. I, I knew I could get it moved. It was just... As soon as you came out, I watched it go from like this, and it just slowly. I'm like, well, it came out of that hole so fast. Once we'll I had just tell real we got it that way. It was. You learned you, 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 you gave it to us, man. <laughs> Shit, once I had boost, it launched her right about that hole. Turn you go up a little bit, Frank. Then you can go up that much. But at the time that I was working on the What the fuck? <laughs> so about that board breaking, guys. <laughs> that and it's not. Hey, this thing's still recording. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. It, it just turned into off. I'll get it. It's still recording? Yeah. Okay.